Hey Gypsies, welcome back to my channel and happy Monday. I'm kind of glad to be back at work to tell you the truth. It was kind of a cruddy weekend. Um, I know I didn't do any videos this weekend. I actually made a post just letting you guys know I was a little under the weather. And what it was, I've had this issue for a couple of years now where I have some type of um, inflammation in my rib, my collarbone area. It happened a couple years ago and I went to the doctor about it and it was like every time I took a deep breath it would really hurt like back around my ribs and they said it was just inflammation and stuff and I just feel like it's since then moved up. They wanted me to take so much ibuprofen to knock that out and I'm just like no I can't. There's no way I can take like 800 milligrams of ibuprofen like four times a day. I, there's just no way on earth I could do that. So I took a little bit and you know, it just flares up every now and then. And usually I've kind of pinpointed it to if I play with a baby, you know, like for like two days in a row, if I play for with a baby, which is kind of weird, but um, like use, I guess just bouncing a baby and just using my arms like a lot, this will flare up and I'm telling you like every time I move my neck like there is like an area that goes down through here I don't know what it was but just like just terribly painful and it's you know it's nerve-wracking and aggravating because it's like you feel like it's right in your heart and I'm just like you know but I've had it so many times I know it wasn't my heart so it's just and it's gone now you know I'm just like I mean I'm still sore and everything but it's not like it was and when that happens I just basically have to take it easy for a couple of days which is exactly what I did and I'm feeling good today at work ready to do a Dollar Tree haul super excited about working half a day tomorrow going to Dollar Tree and just keeping these hauls coming for you guys so I do apologize there was no cooking and crafting this weekend there's no Dollar Tree hauls there's nothing so <clears throat> but we shall continue on. So I just want to go ahead and start with this haul. Um, before I start with anything, I want to show you guys these. I had hauled a few of these a while back. Now, probably about, I guess I had about 10 of these because I got what they had because like my bathroom is unfinished and I actually put these, the ones that I found uh, around my shower, like uh, around the top of my shower and around the sides. I didn't have enough and I've been contemplating like ordering like some off of DollarTree.com and you had to order a box of 50 for that and I've just been like oh I don't want to do that because I don't feel like I need 50 so when I was going through the aisles the other day I found a box that had a bunch in there I got 19 of these I left 18 in the back I just brought the one because I want to do as much of my bathroom as I can with these because these look so spa-ish around the tub and stuff I absolutely love them um, yeah, so I definitely have enough to do around the finishing around my tub and that those areas and then I may do like another whole wall in my bathroom. It's according to how many I have left because my bathroom's not that big so it wouldn't take a ton to do a wall. But I'm just so excited that I found these and they look so like you are totally at a spa. And the only thing I really, I feel like I need is like greenery like a hanging fern or something you know it just seems like an outdoor spa setting i don't know but i absolutely love that so yes i was super thrilled to found, find those because i literally did not want to order a box of 50 because that's 50 bucks you know i just i just didn't want to it's just i just didn't want to let me take a drink my throat feels a little bit scratchy all this pollen this ragweed is killing me and let me just say, wait a minute. Where I haven't really gotten out and hiked and stuff like we used to. I mean, we used to be on on trails every single day almost. And the last couple years, like, no, no nothing. Like, no, I don't know. 
but I have noticed such a difference in my allergies. Like, they're so much worse. My eyes water continually. Like, I think whenever you're out in nature, you kind of build up sort of a tolerance for that. And then not having been out in nature in a while like that, like, it, it, it kills me. It kills me. So, like, my eyes, like, poor. Like, I don't even know why I bother with makeup. Like, my eyes water constantly. Like, I'm constantly dabbing my eyes. It's ridiculous. So, anyway, there's my thought for the day. Okay. Let me show you what I found. This is wish list, guys. Wish list. I just think these are so cute. I'm just going to get them both out at the same time. It is the little candle holders that look like the little mason jars. And the cool thing is, like, take that lid off if you want to. So they are that close to mason jars. They say homemade. Homemade on there. And I just think these are fabulous. I've... I feel like I may have saw them one other time and didn't pick them up, and then I kind of regretted it, and then they had them back, so I'm like, how exciting. So, I just think these are so cute. I think they would look so cute with some little fairy lights in them, or even candles would be really just super cute, you know? They're just adorbs. I'm not going to put that up there because it's going to slide. And then, I saw this adorable little thing. This is just to burn the little um, tea lights in. Excuse me, I just had lunch. Um, burning the little tea lights. So I just thought this was so cute. You know, it's just adorable. So I grabbed it. And then this is something that I've been seeing other people haul. And I'm like, I, don't, I didn't really feel like I, I cared for it until like I saw them in person. And I'm like, you know what? These are really cute. They're like... I don't know if you'd call them like futuristic looking or just like orbit. I don't, for some reason, I'm getting the word orbitron. Why? I have no idea. Maybe Orion. I don't know. I don't even know where that word's coming from. Like, just disregard me right now. Um, but anyway, I love these in person. I think they're really, really cute. They just look space XY. I don't know. Just so cute. Now I can't even remember what's in here, so this is going to be a surprise. Oh, yes. I do remember now. It's not frozen. It is a... Ta-da! What are these called? My mind went blank. Snow globe. Snow globe, and it's Santa. Oh. Who doesn't love snow globes? Like, as a kid, man, I could play with one of these for hours. Just create your whole little imagery in your mind. Oh, my gosh, they're just so cute. I shouldn't put them up there. And then I've got two more things in here. What do we have? I think I got another snow globe. They have three or four different ones. Maybe I got two more snow globes. I don't know. I think they have three or four different ones. I didn't get them all. They had an elf I wasn't that crazy about. Here's this one. Look how cute. There's a snowstorm going on right there. So cute. I just love it. And then, I think, is this other one? This other one's not a snow globe. So they must have had three, and I left the elf sitting there. Now I feel bad. So this is like the tea light holder, the other tea light holder. I think that the way that's painted, I'm loving it. Absolutely loving it. So, I love that they have the leaf green, but they just have, like, the other one, the other colors in there. I just think that's so pretty. I think they had more of these as well. Now, I could have got a matching set, but they probably won't even go in the same room, to tell you the truth. I got a ton of those tea light candles that, you know, I need to burn. The ones the Dollar Tree started carrying this year. Of course, I think they carried them before this year as well because I found an old pack of the green ones. But, yeah, these are great. I, this one's my favorite, though. I love that. Okay, so there's that bag down. Now, let me do just a hint of Boro, okay? Just a hint of it. See if I can find it. What is that? What is that? 
Is this my Boro? Yeah, this is just a hint of Boro. My husband said we're out of comment, so I'm like, okay, I got you on that. I like that lavender comment. comment. That lavender comment they had, um, haven't seen it for a while. So, like, there for a while, that was, like, all they had. And then, I guess they just sold out of it, and now they have this. But, you know, comet is, like, the best thing to clean tubs with ever. Because it's got that abrasiveness. And then the last time I bought one of these bad boys, the sprayer didn't work on it. So, it's still sitting on my kitchen cabinet, or kitchen counter to tell you the truth it's still sitting there and I'm like I just I'm just gonna grab another one and then I'm just gonna put the other one under my sink and then when this one runs out I'm just gonna refill it with the other one so I love the spig and span I think it works really good and it smells really good and it's antibacterial so it's spray cleaner through the smell is fresh citrus and the color is pretty awesome it's like a zombie green so yeah there's my Boro for the day. Maybe not for the day, to tell you the truth. I don't know what else is in here. We're going to see, though. We are going to see. It's beautiful out today. It says it's 57 degrees, baby. 57 degrees. I love it. I love this kind of weather. The other morning, I went out to get in the car. Frosted. Absolutely frosted. I'm like, yes. Love it. Okay. Let me get this bag and put this one over here. Like, I could use a nap right now. I had two boiled eggs, a string cheese, and a little pack of lemon pepper yogurt. Yogurt. My God. Lemon pepper tuna. Where in the world did I get yogurt? Like lemon pepper tuna that I got from the Dollar Tree that has the little spoon with it. Because I thought I had a um, beef jerky up in here or one of the smoked sausage sticks absolutely couldn't find it so i'm like i'm gonna need me some more protein so i dug in my backpack boom boom baby tuna okay you guys calm down hold on okay here is a wish list i was looking for these it's the entman's hot chocolate original k-cups you get three to a box i got these Oh, hold on. Let me try not to drop it on the floor. I got these because sometimes Jack likes to have some hot chocolate and Entman's. <coughs> these are going to be fantabulous, okay? They really are. I have no doubt these are going to be wonderful because Entman's donuts, like, they're so good and, like, they're expensive. Like, Entman's stuff is expensive. So, I thought it was kind of cool to, to have these at the Dollar Tree. So, yeah. Those are going to be good. And then, I grabbed these for a snack. I don't know if these are new or not. I don't think they are. But they are. It's a new size, it says. Um, Fresh Pick Goodness Harvest Snaps. So, these are Green Pea Snack Crisps. The original lightly salted. So this is a pretty good size bag. It's a two ounce bag of snap, snap pea crisps, crisps. Um, thirty. And wait, what? Thirty three grams of carbs. Whoa, whoa, baby. Oh my gosh, I'm dropping everything. Okay. And then I grabbed these. These are cool looking. First of all, look at them. Scrub a bug. So cute. It's car windshield, headlights, and grill bug remover. 100% cotton terry, 100% polyester net. So there's a net over a terry cloth, cloth, I guess. And you get, is it two? Or is it just one big one? I feel like it's two. Oh, it's two. Automotive scrubber cloths. I'm telling you the packaging got me. Look at it. Scrub a bug. And how, well, how about scrub some poop? Because, like, on my way to work this morning, a bird did its business while flying over my car, okay? While flying over my windshield, a bird did his business. Yeah, some birds. Some birds, they just don't give a crap. Pun intended. Okay, so I got some pictures here. 
These are cute. These, they had like boxes and boxes of new pictures. And so I went through them and I'm like, my gosh, I had to make myself stop. There still could possibly be some more in the back. I can't remember. But I just got the ones that I felt like I couldn't live without. Hold on, loud truck going by. Okay, so first off, can you see that sweet face? An ostrich, guys, or an emu, whichever. It's an ostrich or an emu. It's from Special Moments Memories, the Special Moments Memories Collection. Wall art, it is from Greenbrier, but I guess they have different collections. So the Special Moment Memories, I thought it was adorable. He's got a tie on, okay? He's adorable. Look at him. Or her. I guess she can have a tie on. It's just, I don't know. But it's so cute. So I grabbed that one. And then I got this one for Jack to hang in her room because I just thought that unicorn is the bomb. That unicorn with its gold horn, she's the bomb. I mean, she's gorgeous. She's a diva corn. Absolutely. So beautiful for a little girl's room. So pretty. And then I love this right here. I got this to hang in my room because I love colors. And it's just so boho. Boho chic, baby. Those colors are so bright and vibrant. It says love. I'm just absolutely loving it. So, yes. And then, how many of these bad boys are there? So, this is another special moments and memories collection. Do they all say the same thing? Looks like they do. Look. Yeah. So, they're all special moments, memories collections. So, I feel like, I mean, I feel like I have several with books and lipstick and perfume. I do not remember this little makeup palette right here. I don't remember that. So, I'm like, I don't know if I have that or not. By the way, check these nails out. Aren't they fabulous? This is week one of my October nails. Week one, baby. They are great. So, anyway. Yeah, Yvonne sent me those. Okay, guys. There are the pictures. And I have one more bag. One more bag, baby. All right. And once again, like, my eyes watering off. I try to... I have this little eyeshadow palette that I got from the Dollar Tree. Just carrying it with me. Because, like, it rubs off my powder. Because I'm always dabbing my lower eye and see it's gone again so I'm trying to apply, apply a little bit more powder under there so I don't look like a dork oh well okay now we have now I told you the other day I knew that I had bought another pack of these here they are it's just these silver gorgeous poinsettias for crafting or the tree or whatevs whatevs and then I grabbed these right here. These are really cool. It's still October. We're still planning on crafting. So I got these Halloween picks. They are just really cute bats. They look like marshmallows to me. They look like marshmallow bats. So I'm feeling them to see if they're marshmallows. They're not marshmallows, but they're so cute. And they're glittery. Are they glittery? Are they glittery? Yeah, they're glitter. Are they? I think they're glittery. Let me get my glasses on. You think I'd be able to see glitter? Yeah, they're sort of yeah. Well, they're sort of glittery. I don't know. It's just like a weird. It's a weird glitter. I don't know. They're sort of glittery. Okay. I'm looking at the clock, thinking if I hurry up with this, I can like lay my seat back and close my eyes because I really want to take a nap. Okay, so I found a couple of air fresheners. Wizards. This one's Wizard. Um, I don't remember getting Morning Mist. So I'm really, really wanting to smell it. So I'm going to spray it out the window and hope a little bit of it wafts back in here, okay? It did. Ooh, yeah. That smells really good. That smells really good. So Morning Lily. I was just wanting some of every 
one of the collection that they have out right now. And I'm like, I do not remember that because I think I would. It smells really good. I like it. So morning mist. Did I say morning lily? Okay. And then I grabbed two of these. These are Berry, Merry, and Bright Limited Edition from Glade. Perfect for the holidays. That packaging has got me like, ah, loving it. I'm going to spray it outside too and smell it, hopefully. Oh, ooh, I smell the berries. Like, give me another whiff. That wind's blowing. I like it. I smell the berries, but I also smell the cinnamon, which cinnamon is everything. You can see like that right there. Like cinnamon is everything during the holidays. It's wonderful. I really like it. It says notes of Merlot berries and spice, and I totally get those notes, and I absolutely love it for the holidays. So, yes, baby. Got two of them bad boys. Super excited. I have got quite a collection of sprays I have to say quite a collection and then I think these are new guys um, I've never seen them before and I'm like I want to remember this this is veggie chips and they are carrots it's by gnome gnome these bags are so so light it just says just crispy dried carrots nothing added simple food treasure by gnomesnacks.com www.gnomesnacks.com it's only a 0.7 ounce bag not even a whole ounce of course any kind of freeze dried stuff stuff <coughs> any kind of, of dried veggies is normally super light um yeah so they do have some sugars i don't know what it's coming from Probably because the carrots themselves. The car carrots are high in sugar. So, I just thought those would be really cute for Jack to try. And then they also had this from Gnome. And this is a Fruit Chips Mango. So, same size bag. They're non-GMO. But just have never seen those before. So, I thought, you know what? I'm going to grab them. I'm going to grab them. And then, grab my hubby. Two more bags of these right here. So, this is the Caramel Apple Filled. These are the hard ones. He likes these. Um, he really loved the ones that was sent, sent to him. Um, they were the Cocoa Filled ones. And then two bags of those. And one bag of the Caramel Apple Filled. He went a little crazy. And he's like, why haven't you brought these home? I'm like, no. He's like, thank you for these. I love them so much. I said, they're not for me. They're not for me. I've looked. I couldn't find them. So somebody sent them to you. I don't want to say the wrong person. So I'm not going to say who it was. Just because I don't want to do that. So anyway, I grabbed him two more of these. I don't know. I don't think these are out year round. So I'm just trying to get like, um, you know kind of a, a stash of them because I'm pretty sure they're not out year round and then I have one more thing and I think I'm going to put this in my daughter's Christmas bag and all it is is a little I think this would look really good in her room her room is done in white and gold and I just think that was that's going to be really pretty she loves Paris themed stuff which I think she has her room done in Paris themed so I just think this is just so cute and it will really match her decor I know she just put a bookshelf in her room yesterday. <coughs> so, yeah. I'm going to give that to her. So, I just think it was like adorbs. So, anyway, guys. I believe that's it. That is all. <coughs> i got to take a picture of that. So, <coughs> we'll get off here. I wish I could take a nap, but I'm not going to. Um, this is what I've got planned for the day working till probably around 5-ish, maybe 5.15, maybe 5.30, I don't know. Then I have an order to pick up between 5 and 6 at Walmart, my order for the week. I have made a full menu plan for the week for keto and non-keto foods and trying to blend them together just a little bit. So um, I'm going to be doing a video on that. I'm, 
Like my kitchen table is pretty much cleared off. I'm gonna put all the food on. I'm gonna go through my keto and non-keto meal plan for the week. I'm gonna show you what I'm gonna be making and then I'm gonna show you the food and tell you what recipe I'll be making it with. My phone is blowing up right now. Absolutely blowing up. So anyway, I just wanna say thank you guys for watching. If you're not subscribed to my channel, please hit that subscribe button. And if you haven't entered the mask giveaway, for the 7500 um, yes, please go enter that. I'll be doing the giveaway tomorrow. So, yeah. So, give me a thumbs up, guys. Leave me a comment down below. And I'm going to go see why my phone's blowing up. Bye.